Okay, we are back again in the power room. I just want to show you my 23.544 kilowatt lithium power storage live here at the JW Solar USA. If you're just tuning in or joining my channel, please like, subscribe, and share. So as I started this project, approximately three months, going to four months now, when I swap from AGM to lithium batteries with three different cars or powerful cars in the world or very economical power or the one the cars that uh, are mostly used in the world united states and europe i want to introduce to you my 8.544 kilowatt lithium power storage made by or run by Volkswagen e-Golf electric vehicle a German ingenuity but the battery is designed and built by Japan Japanese technology in here this is a 8.544 kilowatt lithium power storage my power wall right here is a killer so this is I configure this for 24 volt I can go 48 volt on it. So four batteries in parallel. You can see here, positive, positive, positive. So it's four stacks of battery. One, two, three, four. And one, two, three, four. So you can see the same thing at the front here. You see all the way down. So this is the e-golf batteries for Volkswagen. Okay, e-golf. Called European vehicle. Made by the Germans. That's the battery they incorporated the technology with the Japanese technology in there. They incorporate that as a smart move. And here, here is another foreign car, which is uh, a Nissan Leaf. The same people, all right? So Nissan is made by Japan. So you guys can see these are the batteries there. These are um seven kilowatt of power i didn't put a sticker right now because i have more projects i have to do into this that's why i didn't want to waste my sticker that's a seven kilowatt of power right there which uh they have seven strings in series seven batteries in series seven batteries in series and parallel them to give you the seven kilowatt which is a 66 amp hours um at 48 volt 500 watts on each battery so that give me a seven point that'll give me a seven kilowatt okay let me backtrack a little bit i'm sorry about this this is a uh, a thousand sixty eight okay a thousand sixty eight i will show you each battery okay a thousand sixty eight times eight that will give you this total right here if you're trying to um you if you're concerned or you want to know the math and this 1068 spam battery and is a uh, 75 amps on each battery 75 amps on each battery and this is a uh, 500 watt on each battery but a 66 amp hours on each battery and the next one I want to introduce to you is our car here north america which is the the ford focus okay a ford focus each battery is a thousand okay one two three four it's a thousand it's a 15 volt 16 volts each battery okay a thousand and this is gives us a total of a eight kilowatt of power storage lithium power storage here so if you combine the Ford Focus which is compatible with the Nissan Leaf that makes a good combination you have a 8 kilowatt there then you have a 7 kilowatt here that gives you a 15 kilowatt to run on a 48 volt set up in a 48 volt configuration okay that's why this is a, 
uh, 60, I think it's a 65.4, something like that, voltage. And um, this is a 57.4. So if I add one more battery on the left and the right, that gives me the same voltage right there. I just choose the preference where I want to lock it in. And that's how I'm going to parallel these batteries, this uh, Nissan Leaf with a Ford Focus so they can be a good combination, a good mix. While this guy here is going to be running independently on a 24 volt. Then I have a 15 kilowatts running on a 48 volt. And I'm running an 8.544 kilowatt on a 24 volt. So guys, this is the secret. This is what I've done, and this is what I already accelerated so fast for just uh, three to four months here to change to swap from my 48 volt, or uh, to swap from my AGM batteries, which are good batteries I used to have. Hey, um, thank you, AGM batteries, different companies I've worked with, and you guys know yourself. I said a lot of things on the video, but um, I've moved on, and this is what I'm doing right now. So this bank right here is going to be running the 15 kilowatts here. Seven on this and eight on that one. It's going to be run by this guy here. Okay, Outback Power. All right. Outback is going to be running. It's a 48 volt. And this guy right here, the E-Golf Volkswagen, is going to be running by this another American machine right here with a Magnusign Magnum. So if you're just wondering how my system looks like, guys, this is my system. And it's more coming, a lot of modification coming from on this channel or on this uh, board right now. It depends. Like I asked you guys last time, I don't have a response because I don't know what you guys think. If I can tear up this board and rebuild it, and uh, try to set up this machine. The magna sign gonna move over there so they can be on the same side. The same, we're gonna be on a 24 volt, okay. And this um, outback is gonna move over here by the breaker disconnect so they can be together there. So all systems gonna be on the same. If I want to talk about one system or I want to film. I can just stay right here and film on just the um, Magnusign. And I want to film just on the Outback. It's going to be all here in Outback. So that's what I'm trying to do. I want to get rid of this. And I want to build something different that's going to sit there to give me more space. Okay. Maybe this um, inverter here is going to go up there. And while this um, uh, charge controller is going to go over there. Okay, and this side I can do all the stuff I want to do in the future. Maybe bring all the uh, gutters and everything to be down here. <clears throat> so, guys, um, you can see we're still making power today, although it's cloudy outside, but we're still charging the batteries. So, guys, this is my system. I don't know what you guys think, and give it a like, subscribe, and share. I'm going to be cleaning up this um, box. Uh, these are all my extra wires. You can see BMS wires there come with, came with the batteries. And these are three hot cables, two hot cables in there, which I'm going to be utilizing, and sensors and all the good stuff. Guys, well, we've done it again. With you guys' support, everything is perfectly fine. And look at that. Okay? Thank you so much for watching my videos and be part of this channel. Live again from Minnesota here with the JW Solar USA. I love you guys all. 23.544 kilowatts of lithium battery storage. 23, I'm emphasizing 23.544 kilowatt total. 8.544 kilowatt. 7 kilowatt, 7 kilowatts here, 8 kilowatts over there, the Ford Focus, okay? Love you guys all. Don't forget to always subscribe, share, and tick the uh, bell.